She make it clap, clap, clap. She make it clap, clap, clap. The same curve. I only run over that. Mimi, no, I'm not getting stoned now. I'm driving, but yes, I see that um, FF Goblin, aka Slimer, aka jealous of my life to the max fucking stalker loser she thinks she has this big revel okay, imagine being so fucking obsessed with somebody and have no life like this is no life no man energy completely coming to my hometown to go to dispensaries or find out interrogate dispensaries um to see if i'm smoking weed imagine imagine so yes i do smoke all right i get weed products in thailand and canada where it's legal i will smoke weed i'm still struggling with giving it up fully and if I say no, when people ask me or I'm avoidant, it's on purpose because it's none of your fucking business. So to make it your business on purpose is pathetic. Like if that's what you've resorted to to content, oh my God, this is why I don't want to come back here because this bitch needs a restraining order. She's fucking crazy. She's insane. She's a lunatic. Like, how do you think that's content? <laughs> We're going to like interrogate this person's life over and over if they smoke weed or not. Bitch, you're not a Muslim. You're a fat, miserable piece of shit who has no life and you have no right to tell another person Muslim or not if they're a good Muslim just because they smoke weed. So suck it and rotate on it. Zoom. So yes, I have some plant products here. Jealous? And so by the way, if you're watching the fucking bitch from one plant, you're a friggin' bitch too. Because I remember going in and she's like, are you a YouTuber? So I'm like, yeah. And she's like, don't worry. I'm like, I know. I'm, I'm like, whatever. Like, you know, she's like, don't worry. I won't tell anybody you're in here. Yeah, sure. I don't care anyway. I don't care. You can't get this through your thick brain. Okay. Maybe you should get an ear cleaner for merch. I don't care. You can't expose me. I expose myself all the time. Here's a bag of cannabis. That's between me and God. Whatever. You're not Muslim. You're not religious. You're not a moral person. So you can stuff it and eat shit. How about that? That escalated quickly. Because someone's like, oh, she's she's go like going to dispensaries to ask about it. Like what? Oh yeah, I'm a rage. I rage, right? She's the one who sits there on her live stream raging every fucking fight, like every day for hours about my life, about whether I'm she's doing a whole live stream about whether or not I smoke weed. So who's raging? Keep your two bucks and give it to her. Thank you. This is the last stupid shit i'm addressing because once i'm gone you're all gonna have fuck all and i can't wait i can't wait for you to be out of my life out of my country like i'm, I'm gone see you and i don't have to come back ever this time i don't have to travel i don't have to do anything so that's it i'm gone forever bud tender confirm foodie beauty has been smoking hot on you're not even muslim you're islamophobic you're a fat wasteless you're a waste of oxygen you're a dog killer and you're a piece of shit so you need to get the fuck out of my life before i do put a restraining order on your flat stupid spongebob ass bitch okay thank you stay away from me I'm glad you're smoking weed. Yeah, and I, no, I don't want to tell anybody I'm smoking weed, you know, because like it's no one's business, really. What I do in my personal life is not your business. So to go digging for it, really? Like, oh my God, do you want, oh, never mind. Look at this. I have gummies, but they're not like high. I don't need the high ones. This is the first time buying them there, actually. You know what? You could, I can, you know what? FF, FF Goblin, they can look up my entire purchase history if you want. I've been there a couple times. I have some sativa yeah it's legal here so yeah i'm just coming on here to say womp womp for your stupid fucking live stream because no one gives a shit like you're the only psychotic person you and your dumb audience with no fucking brain cells who give a shit if someone smokes weed like really who cares so i'm here to admit it and i don't care if you like whatever well, what am i gonna care you're not god like what are you who's gonna judge me oh no ff goblin is judging me on morality please please who the fuck are you you're nothing oh my god me they're freaking retarded i can't stand them like seriously oh, why should her mom care why would my mom care like i'm 40 years old four zero not four not 14 i'm 40 like my mom can't tell me what to do anymore i can smoke weed if i want it's fucking legal here hello i don't smoke weed at my mom's place you don't know where i smoke weed so don't worry about it and i'm allowed to smoke outside if i want to yeah like she has a porch here's my bag of weed like whatever who cares what's the big deal like you know anyway all publicity is good pl yeah that's true actually thank you i know a lot of muslims actually that still smoke like you know like for me it's i've been going through a lot of shit and i can't stand fucking being here unless i'm high so i get i smoke weed oh well the woman that works there um i'm pretty sure her name is 
and she was like a huge bully in school i remember her anyway she like was the one she's like oh i won't tell anybody yeah right fuck i could like i hate this town i hate it and i'm so glad that i'm getting the fuck away again <laughs> like i could not i would rot here i would die with the like the i can't so whoever the manager at one plant is is going to get in shit so just wait so ff gunt if you want to publish that and admit that it's one plant bud tender fine because i'll be going to the manager tomorrow don't worry you're a law you're a law she even put the name of the place in cornwall where i bought the weed from so the person exposing me um is gonna get in shit unless they're the manager i guess but then i'm gonna leave a shitty review for them how do you like that shut the fuck up so i booked a flight for me because when i came here i didn't have a flight booked uh return flight because i wasn't sure what i was gonna do i was like i'm, I'm gonna stay you know um Am I going to stay? Like, how long am I going to stay? Stay if I was going to stay longer. And then I made the decision to come back. Even before everything happened, I made the, the, the decision to come back. And then I went back sooner, you know, because dealing with something like this is hard when you're not together. So, oh yeah, he's a rapist. Sure. Has he raped anybody? No. Having a rape fantasy when the other person was telling you they like that is different. You like, you can't even kink shame like that. You can't even say that the person is a rapist because it's a fan, a fantasy during sex. Get a life. If it's consensual fantasy, they're not. Huh? you're spreading defamation and stupid shit as usual this is why i have my comments off but if you want to give me money to talk shit go ahead i'll buy more weed this was bait you fell for it okay what like this is your life this is your content trying to bait me to to respond to you like what kind of loser does that like um i mean you're gonna end up in jail like you don't realize that like you're such an idiot i can't even this is the last you're getting because no matter what you do from now on i don't give a shit you're not gonna fucking get me to open my mouth up about you that's the thing i don't have to think about this loser every day to make content i'm so grateful alhamdulillah <laughs> but i am impulsive so but no i, I mean i'm not going to have i don't want to travel i'm not gonna have to i'm not gonna no way even if it wasn't kuwait it would be somewhere else i wouldn't be here no i there i will have access to medical care there so that's good news yeah ffg like sh she's damaging this worker's life well you know what it's, i don't know it's cornwall i don't think they're anyway i don't know but it's like, I remember that woman being a bully in high school, and, like, she still is one, clearly. Because um, I'm, I'm definitely reporting that to that company. I'm just going to go online and report it. I know the person's name. I remember you from high school, bitch. Yeah. Sorry for the swearing. I'm just... These are things I want to work on. No, I'm not... Do you want me... You know what? How about I out myself totally and write a whole list of every bad thing about me, and then whatever, you know? Like... No one cares! I don't want... I want to stop swearing. I want to not smoke as have to smoke as much you know but like realistically i've been a muslim for what a year and i've been a canadian pot smoker for how many years and i'm sorry but old habits die hard sometimes especially when you've been using them as a crutch you're really not outing anything you what the hell <laughs> like these people judge me on how i look and they don't even show themselves on camera because they're so ashamed of how they look because why else wouldn't you do it why i just don't feel like it no there's literally a twitter from yaba i have the screenshot saying really condemning people for not camming up when they you know when they react she hasn't done it in how long like these people are hypocrites they contradict themselves every day they contradict themselves in their theories every day oh i'm so broke i'm not making any views only 7k views i have no money but i somehow have the money to give ten thousand dollars to uh salah apparently which is not true i have you know i support a whole ass man who supported himself before me like i just anyway it's a violation of customer privacy so i hope you enjoyed your five what how, how much cloud do you think this person is going to get longer than k than uh k trasha k bella how long how long do you think the cloud is going to last have you been lying to your husband about pot no nope he's not stupid he knows he can tell <laughs> obviously she was high in thailand a little bit <laughs> it's legal there too and i sometimes like i'm not like i said i'm not perfect i have trouble it's like kind of an addiction for me you know it's like it's like i said it's been a crutch like i would do wheelchairs every night you know at least um it's not that bad now but even then even if i did it I, I don't owe anyone especially no one like that person or that thing an explanation of what i do with myself you know muslims who use cannabis it's especially like a lot of islamic countries it's not legal obviously i don't even think there are any that have that it's legal in which i respect that when i'm in kuwait i respect the rules i don't um i can't get any there anyway i mean you know can't you can't have alcohol nothing and that's what i, I like that about kuwait you know but when i'm here i be a little because i just feel like even when I, before i went to kuwait the first time i was always 
high here. Like I had to be, I don't know. Anyway, maybe I have a lot of trauma to deal with from here going way back in my life. And that's why it's not really a happy place. It's nostalgic sometimes and I'd like seeing my family, but I think I will need to get some kind of mental health help when I'm there, even remotely. I don't like going face to face with someone. So they don't even have faith in their life. No, because if they did, they wouldn't be making the content they are. You'd be going right to hell, which you're going anyways. See ya. Fuck you. I have like, I spent, I went shopping. I, I, I got a lot of things coming um, that I have to have sent back. Like someone in my family is going to have to return the things because they're going to be coming later than when I leave here. No, there's no one who wants to eat poo-poo. I mean, I, after this, I want to crap on K Bella too, so. Ooh, daddy. I just don't think you're being mean. You're being real. <laughs> well, I say mean things like calling someone the B-I-T-C-H, but it feels good. You should try it. No, I'm just joking. Anyways, guys, that was fun venting, actually. Now I'm torn if I should do it more often or not. No. <laughs> I'm going to make a customer service complaint. What do you think about that? I think that's good. I'll say, I came to shop at your store, and one of your bully employees um, revealed to someone that I was in shopping. When are you flying back? I can't say exactly when, Rebecca, but uh, it won't be too, too long. <laughs> like, you know, it's the last week. You can't cancel me, so move on. Hi, <laughs> bitch.